Hi guys, Coach Kane here, the Rugby Whisperer, helping you to tame the animal that is rugby. And today we're going to talk about options at scrum time. Now, there's been talk in uh, the world, all the people, we, we want to play this modern game and why they're trying to milk scrum penalties. Well, you know what? Why do we look at the best teams and see the options they take? Let's get right to it. Here we go. Live game, gents and ladies. Crusaders 10, Highlanders 7, 26 minute. Okay, there's Yako Paper refereeing. It's Crusader Scrum. What do the Crusaders do? They milk the Scrum penalty. Wait for it. As soon as Yako says, advantage. Communication. What are they? What is their plan? The Scrum half said, there's the advantage. Look at Kieran Reed. Picks up. There's a set play. So they don't just milk the penalty and they just keep scrumming and just wait for the penalty. They get a free play here, peeps. So they've won the penalty. It means they can try something. And if they make a mistake, he'll come back for the penalty. Look what happens. They waited for the advantage. There's the overlap ball. Sevi Reese, chip ahead. It's dangerous. On another day, that ball sits up and it's a, it's a try scored. And if there is a mistake, they go back for the penalty. In South Africa, we should be doing this. We've got brilliant scrummages. We do very well. Uh, the, the, the baby box down at 20s, they were scrumming teams. Um, the Sharks have been doing it. The Bulls have been known for it. The Lions, brilliant at scrumming. Scrum, get the scrum penalty, but don't just stop there. Have a set play. Have a play ready to strike to score. Because if something bad happens, you come back for the penalty. You can kick for the touch. You can get the, uh, you get the extra meters, or you can take the three points, or you might just score. This is Kane, the Rugby Whisperer, helping you to tame the animal that is rugby. And please like, share, and subscribe these. And uh, let's see if we can win a Rugby World Cup.